Hey guys, it's Monica. I thought I would share with you a couple of things that I have been so loving in February. Now, none of these are brand new to me. All of these I have been using, at least in one case, for well over a month and some others for a lot longer. So if you're interested in some of the things that I am passionate about in February, stay tuned. Hey guys, thank you so much for joining me. Can you believe it's already March? I can't. I mean, it's like, where has, where has the year gone? It's March. It's like unbelievable. And I'm really excited about March because Jay and I have an upcoming wedding we're going to. I'm nervous because it is out of state, but we're also combining it with a mini vacation. So we're going to head down south and we're going to go to our wedding for uh, Jay's, my stepson, Justin, Jay's son, and his fiance. They're getting married in, um, the, in the end of the month. And, uh, and then after the wedding, we're going to head over to the coast and we're going to spend a few days in an Airbnb and then we're going to drive back to Savannah and fly home from Savannah to Manchester. And I'm like super psyched, although I don't have a dress yet. I have no idea what I'm going to be wearing. Nothing, because I'm just like not at all. I'm fat. <laughs> Yeah, so I haven't wanted to go, but I've got just a few weeks left, so I have to dig into my closet, go shopping, figure out what fits, what doesn't. I know nothing fits, so that's depressing. So anyways, what have I been loving? Um, I mentioned in January, uh, or in one of my videos, that I had received a PR package from Peaches Skincare, Lisa, and she's here on YouTube, and I'll make sure that I link her channel. Anyways, I did say I was going to try to use the products exclusively as much as possible. I haven't been able to be true to that. I haven't used her products exclusively, but I have used three of her products pretty well almost exclusively since I started to use them, and I have the date on the bottom of the bottle, um, January 20th is when I started this. So um, what I've super been enjoying is how clean my skin feels after I clean my skin, after I wash my skin with her system. It's, I don't know, you know, there's something amazing about clean skin and you know it's clean, it feels smooth, it, it is, it's just a really good canvas and you can put your foundation on or anything else you want on your skin but when you start with that clean canvas, it's a big difference. So I've been using her cleansing system with the exception of one additional product that I've added onto it. And this is, I use the DHC Deep Cleansing Oil. I think I had first heard about this, I don't know, quite a while ago from Marlene Fab and Glam. And I just reordered some more and I got this big one and a travel size for really amazing money off of Amazon. I'll link it below. But I use this as my first cleanse at night. And when I say that, I, f I need something to take my makeup off. I need something that's going to take my mascara off. And I've been using the Maybelline Sky High Mascara and I have been loving it. I also have recently tested out another mascara, but I don't know what it's called because it's one of those types of tests where you have a product that doesn't have any branding on it and you're supposed to see how it works and all that. So I've been using the mascara. I really like it. It isn't a mascara that's going to give you length, but it's going to give you volume, and, I, and I've been enjoying it. So between the Sky High, which gives me super length, and this new mascara that I've been using it that gives me super volume. I think my lashes have been really fantastic. But even though they say, it doesn't say that it's waterproof, I, even though I have a hard time taking it off. So I've been using this to take off all my eye makeup, the first cleanse on my skin every night. I really like this. I, I like an oil. Um, 
I like a bunch of different cleansing balms, but the oil seems to work best on my skin. I have to be super careful when I'm using this to remove my makeup that I remove all of this off because I also use an eyelash serum. I sort of set up a barrier if I don't get it all off. So this will interfere in how the eyelash serum works on my eyelashes and the blank. I took what almost three months off because I had an eye infection and, and all of that. I started using it again and my eyelashes are popping. So yeah. So anyways, back to this. This has been my first cleanse. Then what I do is I start out with her Flawless Exfoliation. I shake it up really good, which I didn't do in the beginning. If you shake it up really good and then you open it, you literally on dry skin you literally need maybe the size of a dime, you know. So you just, if you shake it good and then you gently squeeze it, you'll just get a small amount out. The first few times I used it, I didn't really shake it. I squeezed it and I got a ton out, which is way too much. So then you put this on and I'm, I mean, I'm certainly by far a, uh, not a skincare expert, but this is all organic. It is really, it's, it's actually what you do before you actually use your cleanser. Who knew? So I put this on and I massage it in my skin, upward motion. I'm actually giving myself a face massage. Excuse my nails, they're really ugly. Um, I've actually been giving myself a face massage with it and it feels super, super good. I spend a good amount of time around my ears, gently, gently massaging it in. And then I rinse it off. And then I go in with the Peaches Classic Face Cleanser. And I do the same thing. I shake this up really good. And then I put a tiny, in this one, I'm thinking like maybe two peas, you know, that maybe that much because once you put it on your skin and you wet it up, it, 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 it just like foams up really nicely and, I, and it massages in. So I massage that into my skin. And then I rinse it all off. And, and this is their apple cider vinegar toner. You can definitely smell apple cider vinegar in it. And I've been using it on my face. I really like it. So those are the three things that I've been using from Peaches. I just wanted to report back because I've been using them for over a month now. And the one thing I have noticed is there is a huge difference in how my skin, how clean my skin is. Now I have been uh, very much talked about my CeraVe, CeraVe, I love that. But there is still a big difference in this system. I would have never have thought to exfoliate, however gently, on dry skin before you wash. I would have never have thought that. So I have just been enjoying the heck out of this. She does have a polish. I don't have that. Um, but I, I don't know. And I, I do have her vitamin C. I have her moisturizer and I have her mask. I've used the mask a couple of times. I like it. Um, I'm not quite too sure if I'm using it the right way. The vitamin C, um, I used it a couple of times. I found it very strong on my skin, but I, I'm not using it consistently. So I haven't really given that a good try yet. So I've got it put away. I'm working through some vitamin C. I want to finish my timeless. I'm almost done on that. And I've got a couple of other things of vitamin C, so I'm going to determine which one I'm going to go on to. Uh, but I, I've really enjoyed the cleansing, getting clean skin, and really getting clean skin with this. I'm, I'm actually amazed at the huge difference that uh, my skin has gone, you know, has gone through. The, the um, other thing I want to mention, and this I haven't really been using, but I just want to share this with you because I like to sometimes share these things with you and then come back and take a deeper look at them. But this I received complimentary from Rituals via the Octoly Network. And this is an amazing body bath pack. Oh my gosh, is this ever, ever lovely. Smells fantastic. Very, very light fragrance. It has a... Um, sort of a body wash, foaming body wash. It has like a sea salt scrub. It has a uh, hand wash, really nice hand wash right here. And also a body cream. What a beautiful presentation this came in. Really nice. Again, this is complimentary from the Octoly Network. It's going in my shower. I will tell you, I will report back how much I love this, but what I, I'm so impressed with the presentation. This is Rituals via the Octoly Network. I know this is a top selling product, especially overseas. So I'm so excited to have an opportunity to try it. 
One of the things that I talked about in one of my last videos was eye creams. And I did get an eye cream as well from Peaches. I haven't used that one either. But I've been using a couple of eye creams. One that I've actually been using forever. And I actually hate to mention it because I know you can't really get this in the States. You have to have someone that's maybe in the UK that'll buy it for you. Um, but this is the Olay Eyes, the Pro Retinol Eye Treatment. I've been using this for... I don't know, maybe three years now. I really love this. This is the retinol product that I put around my eyes and I'm very consistent with putting this on. So after I do my evening skincare and I get everything all cleaned up, I'm still using this. I know I don't talk about it a lot. I, I really don't like talking about things that I know most of you can't get. But this is, for me anyways, for my eyes, this has been fantastic. So this is my retinol cream. I apply it every night. And then on my eyes, I have been alternating with a couple of products. This is from City Beauty. I love City Beauty eye products. I love a lot of their products that I have used. But this is their Eye Revive Firming Serum. And I've talked about this in a previous video. This is their advanced eye cream. So these are the two eye creams that I use. I will put this on at night. I'll put my Olay around. I'll put this on at night. In the morning after I do a wash, sometimes I use this. Is, this is the one that Sheila talked about, the QMS. I love this stuff. Anyways, I will put this on my lid all around my eyes. And then I'll take this because it's cool. And, and I will put this also. This is the eye firming serum. It's clear. It's cool. It goes on really nice around my eyes. I really love it. And all of that, when I apply it, I've been using a jade roller or a rose quartz roller or a rose or st um, a stone. However you want to do it. But I am loving my little, my little eye rollers. I use the small one around my eyes. I use the bigger one going up my face, going up my neck. I think this one I just got at TJ Maxx. I've gone through a couple of them. I love them. And this has been an all-time favorite. A couple of products that I, I've used. The number seven, Hydro Luminous. I have it in wheat. This has a SPF of 15. It says it's a medium coverage. I find this to be almost like a full coverage for me. It really covers nicely. I'm hesitant about even talking about this because this Hydro Luminous is only sold in the UK. You can't get this in the States. So for my UK lady friends, Bella, um, this stuff is awesome. Beautiful, beautiful coverage on this. I do mix it in the, in the uh, wintertime with a little bit of the LA Girl mixing pigment, the white mixing pigment, just to lighten it up. Because in the wintertime, the wheat is a little bit too dark, where it, in the fall and in the summer, when I'm outside a lot more, it's the color is perfect on its own. So I got two of these, three of these sent to me from, um, one of my subscribers, I actually got the first one sent to me also from the very same person. I got this right around Christmas time and I, I, I know I showed it in one of my videos. I absolutely love this. For a drugstore foundation, this rivals all, all my high end. It really does. But I don't think this is a medium. On me, it's more of a full coverage. So I really like it. And the other thing is my LED mask. <laughs> Oh yeah, I just have to show you because I have just been really enjoying this a lot. <laughs> so it's got all the different modes. It's got the red, it's got the blue, it's you know, the anti-aging, it's got the amber for, you know, any, anything skin issues. What I really like about this is that I, I use the one a lot that I lie on my couch and use. But what I like about this one is that I can just walk around the house with this on and have this on as a treatment and do things. You know, I'm not, I'm not having to lie down on the couch. So I've really enjoyed that a lot this past month. The last thing I want to mention, this is for my wig sisters. So I got the Simply Styling. This is the Light Silk Spray. And I also bought the Sea Salt Spray. These are two sprays that 
I have been using on my wigs. This one was sent to me from Marlene Fab and Glam. And oh my gosh, what a difference it does to a wig. What I have on right now is an older wig. I haven't worn it a long time. Um, mainly because it was starting to go really flat. It was the, the, those beachy waves weren't really beachy waves anymore. They were just kind of bumpy. But um, now I think they're getting back to being more like beachy waves. It's definitely a full look. So I sprayed the Simply Styling. And I also spritzed, you know, a little bit of the sea salt. Oh my gosh. I'll tell you, the sea salt brought back, brought back the beachy waves. I don't know if you can tell, this wig now has a lot of volume and all those beachy waves, they're all back. They're all back. So yeah, it really made an old wig, I think, look really good. And this is definitely an old wig. I've had this one for an awful long time. This is one of my favorites. I used to wear this all the time. This is Henry Magoo's Hayden wig. And I am just absolutely loving, loving what the Simply Styling and the Sea Salt Spray has done to this. So this is such a cool look. I think. Anyways, that's really it for my favorites. Um, Anyways, thank you so much for hanging in there and I will see you in my next video. Oh, and because I never remember to say this, if you are new to my channel, please consider subscribing. I was looking at my analytics not too long ago and 78% um, of you guys watching my video have not subscribed. So please subscribe, ring that little bell. I truly appreciate your support. Bye guys.